even in turbulent water this man is skiing with perfect balance and coordination of muscles but look at this man he is unable to coordinate his hand to touch his nose the cerebrum is telling him to touch the nose but he is still not being able to now in both the men the cerebrum sends impulses to the body so what was the problem in the second man well we'll see there is a mini brain or a little brain under the cerebrum and this portion is known as the cerebellum now unlike the cerebrum the cerebellum does not have convolutions but it has many furrows so these are the furrows now the impulse of performing a muscular activity originates in the cerebrum but the coordination contraction and relaxation of muscles is facilitated by the cerebellum so the impulses of doing a muscular activity is sent to the cerebellum from the cerebrum and then the cerebellum tells the impulses or uh, facilitates the contraction and relaxation and also the coordination of the muscles to perform that muscular activity so in a normal healthy man the cerebellum facilitates balance and coordination now when a person becomes old he has difficulty in walking straight he needs a support for walking he does not have proper balance in his body well this is because with old age the cerebellum gets affected and so there is loss of balance and coordination in the body now look at this video why does a drunk man walk clumsily well this is because under the effect of alcohol the cerebellum gets affected and what are the main functions of the cerebellum yes balance and coordination of muscles so in a drunk man both these functions get affected and that is why he walks clumsily because the balance and coordination of his muscles are not right